hello everyone you are most welcome again on my channel and as you can see this is the list of uh, this syllabus and uh, the writers are in UK PSC syllabus so if you want to get these all notes through uh, you know PDF and through WhatsApp you can directly contact me on my WhatsApp today I am I will be talking about metaphysical uh, points and the topic metaphysicals which is in our syllabus in UKPSC syllabus the term metaphysicals was coined by Samuel Johnson to describe a group of 17th century and they used uh, lots of conceits and paradoxes in his lives of the most eminent poets which got published between 1779 to 81 and in the chapter on Abraham Cowley so he was writing on Abraham Cowley and he used the word metaphysicals and why he used metaphysicals word he used for those 17th century poets who used conceits a lot of conceits in their works and paradoxes if we uh, can divide this metaphysical in two parts Meta means beyond and physical means the world or beyond beyond physical metaphysical beyond physical and uh, which is called a spiritual so whatever is beyond physical or beyond world that is called spiritual so you can say all metaphysicals were kind of spiritual writers here are some major metaphysical poets you can see the list one by one we will talk about them First is John Donne, second is John Herbert and Andrew Marble, Richard Crashew and Abraham Cowley, Henry Vaughan and their important works we should go through. John Donne's works are a valediction forbidding morning and in this he gave a famous example of metaphysical poetry holy sonnets he wrote and um, death be not proud next is john hubbard george hubbard george hubbard's famous works are the temple the country parson jack uh, law prudent term next is andrew marvel his important works you should remember to his coy mistress and the unfortunate lover let me suggest you that just go through these four works definitely if you want to uh, have quite good understanding about metaphysical poets and poetry you should study the valediction forbidding morning holly sonnets death be not proud and to his coy mistress and the unfortunate lover here the temple is also important next richard crashaw richard crashaw's works are epigrammatum Sacrorum Liber, a book of sacred epigram. The meaning of uh, this sentence is a book of sacred epigram. And next, Abraham Cowley, Platonic Love. Here are some other poets. The Flea by John Dill, well, which is very important to understand and uh, study. The Sun Rising, John Dunn, and the Caller, George Herbert, the Pulley by George Herbert again, the, the Retreat, Henry Vaughan, The Definition of Love, Andrew Marvel. Andrew Marvel. And if you can do some quotations, you can go through. We will study in next uh, video some important quotations from uh, metaphysical poets. Hopefully you liked the video. If you liked, please do share and comment. Share your views on this work. See you in next video. Till then, bye-bye. Take care. Good luck for your exams.